Hey there. Today we'll be unboxing the Geisley URGI. This is what the box looks like on the outside. Got a little bit beat up while it was getting shipped out to me. Here's the back of the box. We'll see it's got a little description right here. A little bit of the specifications, mil spec M4 carbine upper receiver assembly. It's got the reliability enhanced bolt carrier group, chrome lined ha cold hammer forged, government profile, carbine gas system, one in seven twist barrel. It's got their airborne charging handle. It's got their Mark 16 rail, their Geisley, uh, super gas block. All right, well, let's get this thing started. It also came with their um, Geisley coffee in the packaging. Let's see here. Let's see that we've got the upper receiver group in here. They start right here in the box. We've also got a nice little sticker. There's a URGI with what looks to be like a vortex. Razor 110 scope on top. Let's see what else we have here. We've got some stickers, big Geisley sticker, their Geisley snake on a bolt, and then their Geisley flag. And then included comes their Super 42 buffer. This is an H1 buffer with their braided buffer spring. That's pretty much it for the box. So, as for the upper receiver group, this is it right here. It's in their packaging and it looks to be covered by all this grease. Let me go ahead and take it out of here. Got that boar flag. And this is 14 and a half inches, a 14 and a half inch barrel. You can see it's pin and welded and it's got the surefire four prong. You see that it also has, oh man, this thing is covered in oil. You see that it's got their airborne charging handle. And this is their reliability enhanced bolt carrier group. So, see it's got the nice little Geisley markings on there. their charging handle that they have on here. This is Geisley Automatics on the side. It is ambi, as you can see here. So, and then here's the upper receiver. It just looks to be a mil spec upper receiver group. Let's hold it this way. Nothing too special about this the upper receiver right here, but we've got this Geisley rail, nice thin low profile M-lock all over it. And then you've got this Picatinny section right here up top. I'm excited to go ahead and try this thing out, see how it shoots. I'll probably upload a video of my build and what it's gonna you know, look like. But here you go, let me know if you have any questions, drop them in the comments, thanks.